I think it slows it down at whatever stage you're in. I mean, by the time the person is in late stages where they're not, they're not able to feed themselves, they're not able to swallow, they're not able to walk, they're bedridden, no, that would not be a time. I believe that it's either the earlier the better. The earlier that the person is diagnosed, and it should be um, you know, a really comprehensive assessment with maybe the, the, the medical doctor, a psychiatrist, a geriatric specialist, Geriatric specialist is called a geriatrician. Um, and they don't just tell right away from looking at a person, oh, this person's got Alzheimer's. Uh, you know, and if they shouldn't do that in the first 10 minutes of an office visit. They really do need, they need a, a brain scan, CAT scan, um, you know, various neurological tests to determine in fact that that is what's going on. Because if it's not, they can give them medications that you know, somebody who looks like they have Alzheimer's, but they're not going to help them because those meds are specifically for Alzheimer's. That's a great question. Thank you.